Hello and welcome to daily that video. In this video, we are going to see one important question, which is why my iPhone is not charging after it reaches 80% charging level. If you have recently purchased an iPhone or using it an iPhone for more than a an year and suddenly noticing that your iPhone have stopped charging or charging it very slowly after it reaches 80%, then this video will give you a better understanding about why it is happening. That is a fix of course, but I won't personally recommend it and Apple also doesn't recommend it to you to try that because it affects the battery health overall so to maintain your battery health it is important to keep that feature on all right without any delay let's see the two possible answers uh, that stands as the reason why your iphone is charging slower after it reaches 80 percent of the charging level number one is if you are noticing a certain level of temperature increase like above the warm temperature while charging your iphone then the ios software automatically slows down down the charging input power uh, that reaches to the battery. This is to reduce the amount of stress that the battery receives so that the phone will not get overheat or beyond you know, the warm temperature. When you place the hand on the iPhone rear side or even on the display while charging, you might be noticing certain level of temperature increase. So if that temperature goes you know, to certain level, like it makes you uncomfortable to hold the iPhone, then that is where we can call it as the above the warm temperature. And the second reason is if you are running iOS 13, then they have introduced a feature called uh, optimized battery charging under settings, battery, battery health, and there you can see the optimized battery charging feature turned on. So this is important to leave it on because Apple itself mentioned to reduce battery aging, iPhone learns from your daily charging routine so it can wait to finish charging past 80% until you need to use it. So it automatically learns depending on your previous day's usage and decides whether it needs to charge charge for the entire day to you know to beyond the 80% level so if you are in a hurry and you want to charge it in the morning and you are putting it on charge and you need the battery to be 100% because you are going to have a very busy day with your iPhone then it is important to turn it off manually just for one or two days you can turn it off but if your usage is going to be just like yesterday or day before then the iOS have learned and perfectly tuned the level to keep it normal and you know the charging will go, go from 1% to 80% without any problem after that the charging will be slowed down like the next two to three percent itself will take like 15 to 20 minutes so that is absolutely normal when you charge the lithium powered battery slower it gives more lifetime so that is the secret here these are the two important reasons why your iPhone is not charging after 80% or you're noticing slow charging speed after it reaches 80% and that is one more thing even if you have turned off uh, the optimized battery charging uh, feature for that particular day and you're noticing that still the phone is slowing down uh, after 80% it reaches the 80% charging power then that could be a problem and that is where you need to go to settings general and then go to reset and then perform reset all settings do not give erase all content and settings it will erase all your data but when you do the reset all settings it just resets iOS system settings and it will not affect any of your data your data will be safe so this is how you can actually fix charging restrictions that happens you know after it reaches 80 percent and i hope the suggestions i gave you to fix this problem is helpful to you thanks for watching and if you find this video useful don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more iphone ipad mac related tips and tutorials thanks for watching have a wonderful day